working as intended. The trees! Not the trees! I can see a quest nearing completion. I can tell because the farmhand's getting everything else that's needed. <laughs> Certainly don't have any more diamonds anymore. We have 1.5k. Guess I'll get more. From Pink Fox Glove. The event item. Oh crap, what did I do? What did I do? What did you do? I don't know, I accidentally upgraded one of these thingies. I don't know what I spent. Uh, probably about 800k. Uh, it was 400k, I did see that, but I don't know what uh, items I spent. It Not a just... big deal, we can always get items back. Let's get some trees. Hey, they'll be worth more because I did the arbor thing. Yeah, but the tree one isn't actually that great. No, it is not. All oh, right, tractor juice. Starfruit tree. Whoa, we got no ribbons. Yeah, I've been buying some sprinklers. Oh, nice. That's a good thing then. Some for flowers and some, and mostly for plants. But plants? We don't need them for plants. Yeah, because then I can come here and harvest things like every three hours, like this fucking crookneck pumpkins, freaking 12.69k every harvest. Ah, a long quest completed. Pick up another long quest. Whoa. <laughs> Finish getting all the trees. Alright, if you get the trees, I'll start harvesting the quest plants. Okay. But yeah, if you have a sprinkler area, you can put chard in, and then you can, you know, leave it on, or, like, leave it overnight, and then come back and it's harvest, because chard usually takes seven and a, uh, 15 hours, but with sprinklers, it's about eight. I'm not going to say it takes exactly half, because sometimes you get winter where water doesn't work. So. Yeah. So when you I also fucked up your uh, I also fucked so up your animals. You butt. There's two types of animals that I need for a quest. I'm just like planted outside the fence because I have nowhere else to put them. And I believe there I'll is one more it. one more type of animal that we need that we don't have planted yet. Yeah, I'll come fix it. I think you also noticed that I bought some land to the southwest. <laughs> but yeah, no. When I planted everything, I think it cost like six million. Jeez, well, we almost got six million. Again. I mean, we were over 10 million when I started planting. Just because the stuff we can plant now is worth like 7 to 15k now. I also did some offensive stuff. I should really turn down that movie in the background. <laughs> what are you watching? It's a terrible horror movie called Creature. So terrible it's good? Oh yeah, I love terrible. The worse they are for a horror movie, the better. Quest complete. When you replant chart, is that recharted? Yes! <laughs> I did that guy a favor, he was a rechard. Dang it. Well, it appears that your life is about to become recharted. I remember that episode. What was that? It was uh, CSI Miami. Yep. I don't know. I think it was just regular CSI, actually. For which one? The one where they uh, uh, murdered the guy because he was, but uh, they didn't care because he was technically that retarded. That was CSI Miami. Yeah, okay, it was. That's why he said the, you know, it appears your life is about to become retarded. Well, no, he didn't say that. He did. No, I didn't. I've watched the entire series. I'll have to find it now and show you. No, the guy, the guy, the, the mentally handicapped guy, his name was Eugene. And he identified the guy because he says the guy's name was Colton. Because And uh, when he's like, you know, uh, Horatio's like, you know, who's Colton? He's looking around for this guy, but Colton was the name of the shoes that the guy, the brand of shoes. And because, you know, the guy figures it out, he murders uh, Eugene by beating him to death. And uh, what the guy, like, admit, he pleads guilty to murder to get 20, 20 some odd years, right? Uh, but that's before, you know, Horatio could prove that he killed Eugene. So then, like, when the guy does it, sticks the deal, right? And he's just like, you know, I was like, oh, you know, we all pay. It's like, I'm going to prison. I was like, I'm not doing less than 25 years. Right? And her Horatio, like, shows him the evidence, right? And the guy's just like, man, I did that guy a favor. He was a retard. And Horatio's like, yeah, it's like, you may have some, have some stuff to overcome, but he, you know, he just put you away for life. I like how at the beginning of the series, Horatio's, like, really compassionate stuff, but as, as, like, season 10 towards the end, he started becoming a real dick. You're actually trying to hunt down that quote now? Yeah, it is actually in the regular CSI, in the episode called Snuff, is the one that I was referencing. What happens in that one? Uh, honestly, it's, like, pretty well the same lines. It's a, uh, uh, 
It's called Snuff because it's a bunch of cowboys, and there was a... Uh, uh, it was one of the rodeo clowns they had killed, and because he was retarded, and that's, uh, it says, by the way, the definition of retarded is to be, uh, hindered or held back, and your life is about to become retarded. Is he taken to jail? I knew I wasn't remembering it, really. Wrong series. Yeah. Well, I just figured because of the, the quip at the end, it was probably, uh, you know, Horatio, but... It's like, do you remember the guy putting on sunglasses? <laughs> yeah. And that's that's where I was like, wait, maybe it was actually Grissom. You missed the cat. You missed the cactus. Can you plant uh, red grapes in the sprinkler areas? Red grapes, kit. Mostly sprinkler areas, though. We need 110. I'm not sure if there's enough sprinkler areas. I'll plant the aloe in the non-sprinkler areas because they only take four hours. That way, later today, I can go and pick this stuff up again. And even artichokes are worth a shitload. They're worth almost 9k. So that's like 2k profit per. Oh jeez. Cook Cooknecks are already at like almost 3k profit per. So I know Cooknecks are winter. And then chard is spring. I think summer's turmeric. We're almost at chard level. Awesome. Oh, I see that. We're one level away. No, not even like a quarter of a level away. I only need one more thing of red grapes and you're done. You're done. Well, we're getting one more because I had to fill the last thing, otherwise it looks silly. Can you get the rest of the beehives? The dude there would have missed one. Yeah, this is way better. I only have to get one row. <laughs> what I should do is just... Uh... Put a lane in the middle so we can just drop them yeah. off there. That's what I'm going to do. All right, Remember, you can pick up multiple at once to move them. You don't have to move them one at a time. Yeah. I was like looking at the quest log. I'm like, why are we missing a quest and we're not? It's just that the seasonal one's over. We need three new types of animals. Wait, I should go take care of that first. Because the beehives aren't going anywhere. I'll plant some more crooknecks for profit. I'll take care of housework. I haven't been playing piano stuff because of how diamond expensive it is. Oh, okay. I started a new song. Because it's getting to be over a thousand diamonds per song, so... I'm just going to go and feed the animals that need to be fed here quick, and then I'll, uh... I'm actually going to extend pens across where you have it built into there anyways. Pen Island? Yeah. Penis land! You can't have Pen Island without... <sighs> pen or island. Or penis. <laughs> this game's like an infinite cycle of just harvest everything. It's like, trees are up again! Yeah, well, I'm nice busy taking to... care of the animals now. It was nice of them for, the, for them to spring it upon us. Good. <laughs> Looks like I only need one more painting to open up. Oh jeez, I just started a sweater. I didn't uh, know that it was near done. Rubber! Don't rubber too hard. Jerk off joke. <laughs> Quincy! Wasn't that like an AOE A &E special back in the day, like 90s, 80s? Mm, probably. It sounds familiar, actually. I know my mom always used to watch all those shows. My mom just watches that stupid soap opera that's been on the TV for way, way too long. That uh, Young and the Restless or whatever. It's been on TV for like, what, 200 years now? <laughs> Give or take. And it, I mean, it still has the same main old dude. What was the soap my mom used to watch? That General Hospital? Uh, if it was still on, my mom would probably still watch it. Instead, she watches that Grey's Anatomy. I mean, to each their own. Yeah, I know. That's what you're supposed to say, yeah, but their own sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so, I mean, to each their own, but some some people's own is wrong. It's like, your opinion sucks. It's wrong. <laughs> yeah, some people are right and some people are wrong. It's just a thing. <laughs> There's no such thing as a wrong opinion. Unless it's different from mine, then it's wrong. But no, seriously, there is no wrong opinions, but... No, I, I guess technically there would be, because if your opinion is about something that is completely false or wrong, then it is a wrong opinion. I believe vaccines cause autism. I'm not touching that. <laughs> this entire game, I have no time to like move stuff around anymore. This entire game is harvest, sell stuff. Harvest, sell stuff. Maybe do some improvements <laughs> during some free time, but... Well, that's because we're trying to do way too much. The thing is, it's not way too much yet until the har until the entire farm is ready to go. How's Pen Island going? Uh, I haven't been building the pens yet, but I've been uh, spacing out the animals. 
Can you need a hundred and what a hundred and ninety blue bell flowers, and they're like a fucking twelve hour flower? <laughs> I have a couple of them built, I think. Yeah, you do. That's what makes a forty instead of thirty six. <laughs> you know, it's nice about sprinklers too. If you ever have to move them, you don't have to actually like pick them all up and move them. You can just sell them and then rebuy them because they only cost they buy and sell for one uh, metal. Save some time. I'm gonna buy another uh, dude. Or so I was gonna more hands. sprinklers, but oh well. Well, it's just because uh, there's I planted three of the things we need, and uh, I'm gonna. Can plant. I go ahead and buy another dude? I'm just gonna put uh, another four animals that we don't have planted yet, because I'm gonna, of course planting animals instead of just you know buying them. But... No, you're planting animals. Yeah. Planting spinach. It's a two and a half hour one. Pretty good profit. It's like almost one k profit. It'll be one k once we level it a bit more. Come on, hit level 60 before spring is over. Let's do this. I was about to say, uh, instead- oh, never mind. Did you, did you buy a new- hey, you bought another farmhand, alright. I can see there's the dude that's still by the bees. Right. That's okay, I'll move the guy that's by the bees back to the fish. No, you won't. I won't? No, I'm gonna move him to one of the other farm areas that's not being taken care of. So you gonna keep on working on Penn Island, or do you mind giving me a hand with flowers, because there are a lot of flowers? Uh, I'll come give you a hand with flowers. Did you grab all the trees? Uh, no. I don't know. What did I, did I miss any? Probably you missed some that are... Oh, and, and apples. And there's uh, some down by the flowers. I'm gonna start using that now. Recharted. Dang it. <laughs> I think harvesting the flowers will get us to level 60. Oh, yeah. I just move in the beehives real quick. I do have some sprinklers on some of the uh, flowers over here because there's some that are worth diamonds. And I want to keep the uh, those ones whole. Cause things like the white hibiscus, where it's like, oh, you use sprinklers, now you get an extra sixty gold for them. It's just like, oh, okay. There we go. Oh, you know what that means? Okay, chart is summer. No, no, I was gonna say you gotta go plant rice, rice in your yard now. Hey, we can make it. Fuck, rice is expensive. Planting one one plot of nine is like 150k. There's some trees over here that needed to be grabbed. I grabbed some trees. I'm not sure if I missed any more, but then I started no, along. The, I started along the lane of flowers. I just chose one lane and started going all the way down it, and then I just come all the way back. This is where you should have, should have spent all the sprinklers. Yeah, but we don't have 8,000 ribbons, and because I was gonna move the flowers soon anyway. So I figure I'll put a space in between them so that, like, if we want to, we can just move the, uh, duders down here. Just harvest for us while we go do other stuff. Oh, these, these aren't, I don't mind taking care of, like, this stuff. This is easy. It's the animals that are a pain in the butt because they're, instead of just when the seasons change or the time's up, it's all the time. Yeah, we don't need them constantly. Like, some of the stuff later only needs to be fed every two hours. Mustard's nice. Get some diamonds. Mustered up some courage. Yes. That's when you call a guy that's stupid with stupidly strong, right? He's got the big muscles, he's a mustard. <laughs> Once we bought like a couple more lanes of land, it'll probably be time to buy those things that you can sell unlimited to. I don't think our supply is that great yet to have to buy have to take the loss yet. Okay, I planted a little bit of rice just right uh, right outside your house. <laughs> At right as you come down the, the, the path there. He who commands the rice commands the world. I mean, it's the food of I champion. A samurai. I was about to say, it's like, I learned that from Bill Hortz's The History of Japan. <laughs> <laughs> I knew where you were going with that. <laughs> I'm a samurai. What if you're Dr. Seuss? Hire a sam I am. Wow, they have trails of gold? Yeah, but they're fucking metal each. Yeah, no, I'm just saying, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know that. My farm's not that out. I mean, on my single player farm, I have like 1500 medals, and I'm still like, no, those are too expensive. A railway track? Yeah, you can actually buy, make rails and minecarts and stuff to take you around. I myself prefer points of interest because you can build 35 of them, so that's usually enough to cover the entire farm. There you go. I'll have to come check out your. Uh... Let me finish selling stuff, and then we can call her there, and uh, as the final thing, I'll come check out my plot of rice. Oh, yeah. And, uh, plant some- oh, you already did plant stuff in the- 
Oh no, this one is. Uh, for the don't use the uh, sprinkler areas. I was gonna plant chard there next season. What oh, what new buildings did we unlock? A farmhands union. Oh, we opened that up. How much is it? Uh, fifty medals. Okay, we should get that next because that fee that gives all the uh, farmhands all the medals that they need or the tickets they need immediately. Yeah. Oh, you want to plant chard in the sprinkler areas? Oh, a lifesaver hut. I should put one of those over by the fish. <laughs> How much is it? Uh, I didn't even look. I wasn't serious about it. I am though. You should build one. <laughs> Actually, I'm, uh -oh. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Once we have the northwest flat area, we'll just put all the fish up there to make one gigantic pond. Yeah. Then I can put like the lighthouse and crap over there. I figure the middle, this whole middle area can be like just like plots and houses and barn stuff, and the entire outside area can be like flowers, animals, fish, and trees. <laughs> yeah, the little plank in between the two. Rice! Hey. I guess new season, so we gotta get the trees again. I'll be right there to help. I'm just finishing off this one fence. I find that offensive. Put uh, a doorway in the middle there of that one. Yeah, I did. I also noticed that it's you build the fences from the inside because even the outside they actually like there is an actual outward facing <laughs> for the fences. Yeah, I didn't you know that. The, I didn't. I didn't know that. So the first time I built, I like look at them. It's like all the fences are different. I'm like fuck, I have to go and like remove and, and like move <laughs> them all around again. I'm like fucking game. Technically, what you want for the animals, I've been doing opposite. So a, uh, here's a little uh, farmer sense for people. You want the boards on the inside. So that way when the animals push on the fence, they don't push on the weak side of the boards. Oh, you said the fence is the wrong way? Uh, no, I think I put them down like that too. I don't care as long as the fence just looks uniform in the game, but... I'm saying in reality... Yeah, I just did it to match the door, because if you notice the door has... You can see the nails on the outside. Yeah, for generally for fences, like, uh, around a house or a garden, you put um, you put the boards or the wire on the outside, because you don't want things getting in, right? But when you don't want something getting out, you put the fence. The opposite. Or, yeah, it's the opposite. So, Because, I mean, if you have it placed where the boards or wire are on the outside, when the animals push up against it, they can push the steeples out eventually. Alright, everywhere else that uh, doesn't have sprinklers, you can go ahead and plant spinach. We're going for some profits. Profits. It's promoting exercise, your profit. I am a banana. Uh, okay, is your spoon too big? Did I what? Is my spoon too big? Aw, <laughs> oh, spoon's <laughs> too big. Alright, is everything planted? Yeah. I think you should come over to my house. I needed a pretty bathroom. Whoa. To Tommy Matt. I mean, those are always there. Oh. <laughs> Hi, this is actually really cool. <laughs> Toilet and cherry blossom painting. Is it one of those fancy Japanese toilets, too? I'm doing laundry. <laughs> <laughs> Wash your hands. Occupado. Have all the water running. Like how you need two showers. Yes, a shower and a bath. There's no, like, just bathtub without a shower head. All right, we did our uh -huh. stuff. Yeah, I know. I put the fan there. <laughs> In your futon. Yep, and a clock, clock sucker. <laughs> Still haven't moved this stuff though, because I want to be able to do this stuff quickly. All right, we did it, buddy. Now it's time yeah. for movie magic. Woo! They should hire you to do sound effects. I know. I'm like a really bad. Uh... Oh, what was that guy's name? On what? He used to do sound effects all the time. Police in, Academy uh... Jones? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling eely good. Dang it. <laughs> Alright, time to harvest stuff. Any quest stuff to harvest? I'm harvesting tractor juice. Trying to get mangoes before the, uh... I think mangoes are up all the time anyways. I'll get the flower that's uh, the quest one. Is it those stupid bluebell flowers? The one that takes 12 hours and we need 190 of them? <laughs> yeah, it is. Well, we're close. 
Yeah, one more day and uh, we'll be done that quest. Oh, I like how you switched around the trees. No, it's just that trees are in squares now, where they weren't last time. Oh, some of them are. I'm just trying to fit them everywhere where you can actually get a 3x3 three three in. Except for the apple trees. So our quest log is pretty much animals and fish. So I guess I'll go harvest the crops. I planted a bunch of cash crops. Every level of chart increases its value by like 600. It's ridiculous. Recharted. Okay, maybe not that much, but... It's like 50 or 60 per level. 15.98 into... Yeah, so it's about 60 gold per level. Artichokes are almost at 9k. I like how the gold bar trees give us diamonds. They should make diamond trees give us gold bars. I know. Yay, monies! Yeah, I planted like the entire field of everything that's worth like at least like 8 or 9k. Oh, jeez. So I think you get a thousand gold times the level per. So at like level 61, I think we got like 61,000 golds, which is like a couple of chard. <laughs> So yeah, I plant chard and crookneck pumpkins in places that have sprinkler. Everywhere else, artichoke. Okay. At least that's what I've been doing, because chard takes 15 hours, but in water it takes about 8. It's not exactly half, because winter sucks. But it's worth so much money. You can suck my chard. Idiot. What? All this stuff is burnt, it's quite charred. And the more you level it, the more it's worth. You have to check if we need any more, like, new animal pens. In Penn Island? Uh, we did last time, I didn't have time to finish them. You at least put them down so we have them, so they can be harvested? Yeah. Or did you not have enough time to do that? No, I put the animals down, I just didn't put the pens up. We were actually just close to finishing bluebell flowers because I had the four over here. <laughs> yep. Oh, fish. I'm gonna do that before the, the duders get over here and do it for me. I think it's too late for that, because I think I had a duder up there anyway, because I was doing it last night. Well, he's not grabbing these farfish. Yeah, he can only reach the three big pools from where he's at. I'm moving him anyways to gather the honey. That and so I can get him away from letting me fish. You know what? Fuck you. I like the efficiency. <laughs> <laughs> it's efficient. Oh, artichokes are worth 9k now. I just noticed to get like the quest done, you know, the uh, seasonal quest? Yeah. You can plant the maximum amount on various farms, but the quest like carries over between farms. Yeah, because I have like 400 and planted on one farm, it's just like I can plant 400 more on this farm, it's just like, alright, that's that makes it easy. Goading these guys with food. Tickets? No, it was Meal tickets! Oh. <laughs> Goat luck with that. <laughs> oh, time to time to harvest our donkey fur. <laughs> Remember, don't start any music if the music, music's done. Yeah, no, I won't. Uh, I have one still going in my house, and that's all I did. Alrighty, what am I planting in the crookneck pumpkins? Uh, crooknecks in the sprinkler areas. I'm busy selling the everything. I'll have to double check the animals and see if we're missing any. I'll put these pumpkins down first. Yeah, because we won't be on in when, uh, when uh, summer hits. No. And that's when chart is available. So pumpkin, uh, crookneck pumpkins are a good alternative. It's a good thing we leveled up our pumpkins. And then everywhere else with non-sprinklers, I think we can plant more artichokes. Okie dokie artichokey. <laughs> you dummy. <laughs> that happens when you uh, you plan to make a really good painting, but instead you fail. You had an arty choke. Yeah. Then we'll work on uh, double check that we got all our animals and start making the rest of the pens. Red Highland. Penis land. Dang it. What? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, time to take an hour and harvest all the flowers. Okay, yeah. I do have all the animals up that we need. And yellow orchids take three days to grow, but without sprinklers they're worth 7k. And we're saving up our metals because we're getting the uh, farmhands union, right? One of the wonderful utility buildings. The heck is a Jupiter beard anyway, that's a flower. I mean, I can see the beard part of it, but I don't know what it's, it's called. It sounds, like, it sounds like a barbarian's complaint. Jupiter's beard! <laughs> <laughs> Strong gold tulips as opposed to weak gold tulips? Looks like this game is just about to spring something on us. Oh, and then I'll be tree gathering time again. Yep, the endless cycle in this game. Man, there's so many flowers now. But hey, profit for just waiting around. Hey, it's for horses. 
two rows down onto the third row. Put a church on it, it'll be a saint's row. Dang it. <laughs> Lots of leveling up flowers, though. Season change, get the, get the trees. The trees, not the trees. <laughs> Dang it. Can you do me a favor? Can you sell, me, sell some of the flowers? Because I'm probably going to end up maxing out here. Oh, I better harvest the leprechaun pot of gold. I mean, you get, do get a gold nugget out of it. Too bad you couldn't just put a little uh, duder over here by where all the sales are, and then he would just automatically sell things if there was enough in it. That'd be broken. Oh, looks like we're actually gonna finish the quest. And then everything's already harvested, so we won't be able to finish the next quest. Which edge are you gonna extend the uh, animals to? Because I would like some of the outer edge to be for the fish as well. So let's just say what I'll do is I'll continue the pen across there. And I won't put the animals any farther west. I'll go east instead. I'll fill out the rest of that uh, pen that they're, they're like that one area that they're in in the north side of it, and then uh, the rest of the way west can be for fish. I won't move the fish there. I don't want to tell all the way to the corner. I mean, just do whatever, and I'll. Uh... You'll adjust your animal. Yeah. That's a bit of work to move all the pen islands. Well, I mean, I won't move them. I'll just build around, or not any farther, I'll just go east instead of west. Rice level up! Rice, rice, baby. That's a funny song by Kate Rigg. Yeah. My mom liked its lyrical content. I don't think I recall that one. Recall what? The lyrics for Rice, Rice, Baby? Oh no, you're saying it's miracle. Oh. Lyrical content. Lyrical content. Sorry, I, mis I misheard thinking you were talking about a different song by kind of like the same person. It's like English isn't your first language either. It really isn't. It's broken English. That's my first language. And second. Redneck English. Yeah, I think I know multiple styles of broken English, but not the proper one. Various English dialects. <laughs> yeah! So Farmhand Union is 50 medals, so... Close! Getting there. I don't know. Yeah, and then it's all downhill after something creates a union, though. <laughs> I don't know, some unions are good. They start out with good intentions, but then, uh, and it goes downhill from there. No. So, this this right here, the fruit market, is the only one that has very minimal loss. Because it sells 125 fruit for 60 diamonds. That's not too bad. Yeah, because generally 120 fruit is worth 60 diamonds. It has some, yeah, so it's okay. a very tiny loss. We only lose five, five fruit for the sixty diamonds. While everything else, like the fish here, you sell a hundred for forty, so you're losing, like you're losing ten, so you're losing twenty percent, which is pretty significant. Yes. I'm gonna build another jam press here on the hill since there's uh, room for it. I'm gonna jam it in. Some more vegetables. Get some diamonds back because I bought land. And land's getting expensive. For it lands in hot water. Yep. And I'll finish off the Jikama quest in some off time because it's just plant 120 racism. I'll check the houses here in the final bits. Like if you were married, Mike, would you have <laughs> would you have pets or kids? <laughs> well, I mean on a farm you'd probably have both. Yep, I just wanted to make the orchid joke. The pun. Alright, so much work on the farm done. Alrighty, everything's been sold to a properish amount. He's collecting donkeys, so I will uh, sell some of their fur so it's not looming over us. <laughs> oh, well, I mean, there's a bunch of empty spots right here. Oh, we can't plant chikamas right now, that's why. Yeah, racism is autumn and uh, winter. Yeah, when people have to be cooped up. Some people have to be cooped up, they become racist. <laughs> yeah, I think that's it then. Oh, can we plant cabbage? We quite quest complete! We're not quite enough space. Oh wait, we might have exactly enough. <laughs> exactly <laughs> that enough. We have cactuses, we have the ducks, so that quest will be pretty simple to complete too. Yep. I'll just double check that there were no other quests completed. Yeah, no, I got all the animals that are required. I even built some fences. Oh, I gotta collect these chickens. Are you getting egged on? Yeah. Alright, looks like everything's planted, everything's good to go. Fish, you can go fishing. I won't take that away from you. 
This time, you mean? Yes, man, our farm's looking good. Yeah, it is. I mean, if I ever saw two people trying to run a farm like this, I'd laugh, but... <laughs> well, I guess technically none of the stuff would be ready at all times, so... We'd need way more farmhands. Well, that tropical fish quest should be done next go. Unless we get really bad catches and do one, one, one. If that happens, I'll just blame you. Uh, no, if it, well, it can't be my fault because I I would catch better. I mean, it's not my fault because it's I'm Asian and we automatically get good luck. No, it would be your fault for leaving it to a farmhand to catch the fish. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go and fish and make sashimi. Sashimi is delicious. I've never been too good at the raw raw sushi. I like the smoked stuff though. Smoked salmon is delicious too. Yeah. Oh, tree time again. I'm ignoring it because I'm in my house. So there's there's no trees in here to harvest, which means it's not harvest time. A cactus quest item. Fine. I was kidding. I got it. I was like <laughs> right, I was like right here. There, just get the cactus. All right. Thanks for watching. Thanks everybody. for watching. We need more land and move we need stuff. more diamonds for that. Yep. Hey guys, if you like this video, make sure you leave a comment, like it, and share it. You can click on the left button if you want to subscribe, and the right one to watch more farm together. Thanks for watching!